Mike is on period. What is up, my friends, and welcome back to BBI Pilots. And boy, do I got something for you. You're going to love it. And uh, I <laughs> just wow. That's, that's all I can say about this is just wow. So for that said... This pilot clearly was confused. Um, he might have got a license out of a Fruit Loop box, I think. Oh wait, his simming his simming skills came from the Ronald McDonald House, I believe. I'm not sure, but we're gonna listen to it. I'm sorry, Ronald McDonald. I shouldn't assault you, but. Uh, Pat 11 loaded with Thomas comma one yeah, minute 51 seconds. Is, you guys. Volume 70 percent. Mic is on period. I'm gonna, I'm gonna mute my mic. Double so tap I, to the same period. You, hear, hear, you gotta hear this. Southern 124 on ab to sea salt. Wind 150 at 8 runway 8 right there for takeoff. Roger that, Delta 124. We're still getting set up here. Not quite ready for the pushback yet, but we will advise. Delta 124, you're on the runway. Am I? Am I not? Am I seeing something wrong? Delta 124. Um, I currently do not know where I am. It's possible I may be on the runway at this point in time. Give me just one second, please. Are you happy now? You made a fucking spectacle of yourself, you fucking clown. Are you happy? Delta 124, how soon are you going to be uh, ready for departure on 8 right? Quite soon, Delta 124. Miami Center, Delta 124, ready for takeoff. Delta 124, on at the sea salt. Wind 110 at 12, runway 8 right, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, runway... Uh, 8 right, Delta 124. Miami, approach Delta 124. Repeat that squawk for me one more time, please. Time. Miami, approach Delta 124. We're having some technical difficulties. We'll have to disconnect and try again. Mike is on period. Now, I'm sorry, but I, I just want to say I'm glad that I wasn't that pilot because that would have been just absolutely humiliating. Listen, bud, uh, you might want to look out your cockpit window next time and, you know, uh, well, hopefully, maybe maybe you went to study what a runway looks like. I, I, I don't know, but... Wow, <laughs> that's, that's good stuff, that's good stuff, and, and I had to share it with you guys, so uh, there you go, there's a little bit of comedy for you, uh, actually it's a little bit of reality and comedy at the same time, uh, I do know where I'm at, I'm sitting on my seat right now, uh, for the record, I do know where I'm at, and when I put together a flight plan, I, I do know where I'm going, and I know where I'm taking off from, <coughs> and uh, I definitely wouldn't go on that sim saying uh, I currently don't know where I'm at right now uh, I'll get back to you on that <laughs> look when you're on the runway you don't get time for that you gotta get on the runway and you gotta take off because other people are waiting and there was definitely people listening there were people waiting that day to take off I was one of the pilots waiting and then a friend of mine was waiting uh, Mr. Declan was waiting actually he was in front of me Declan was in front of me and I was behind Declan. We was in the queue to go to that same runway, but we had this guy out there. Uh, we'll just call him uh, Fruit Loop. Fruit Loop was on the runway and didn't know it. Fruit Loop took off, and uh, he just connected. Cause uh, I hate to see what happened when he got in the air. I, I, I don't even know what went on in that cockpit, but whew, man, you might want to go over to Eurofly for a little bit longer and learn that a little bit better. All right. Till next time, y'all take care, and we'll talk to you here real soon. Mike is on period. Button. Mike.